For ACUSports.com, I'm Grant Boone as we continue our look at football's spring practice. We're here with soon-to-be junior defensive lineman Nick Richardson. Nick, let's talk about how spring ball has gone so far. Yesterday, uh, Tuesday, you guys got into pads for the first time. How was it? It was good. It was nice to get back in the pads after so long. It doesn't uh, sometimes feel like football when you're just out there in a helmet and shorts, does it? No, it doesn't. Yeah. Let's talk a little bit about your um, – move last year from linebacker your freshman year uh, to that defensive line. It was a heck of a start. You had six sacks in your very first game at defensive end. As the season went along, what did you find out about yourself, the difficulty, the challenge, the fun maybe of playing defensive end? I think uh, the biggest thing was uh, the impact it has on your body. Uh, starting out, uh, I mean, it was always fun, but uh, as the season went on, you got uh, wrist problems, knee problems, and all that. But uh, you just have to tough through it. So, In other words, you didn't feel those things at linebacker? Uh, not as much, no. Yeah, just because of, of what you're having. You had your hand on the ground, right. Uh, let's talk overall about the defense because uh, you weren't – you were kind of indicative of, of the overall changes. You guys went from that 3-4 to the 4-3. Uh, and – it was it was successful, you'd have to say. I mean, from your freshman year when you guys allowed, I think, 29 and a half points a game, you only allowed 21 and a half points. Right. Tell me, big picture, how you felt uh, the changes took from your freshman year to the changes last year. As far as the defense goes from uh, the switch, I think uh, it was easier to fill the gaps up front, uh, easier to stop the run, and uh, I think we were overall in a better position to be a better defense. Uh, tell me about Coach Doolin and Coach Roboto. You would have, he would have been your position coach. Coach Roboto would have had you stayed as a linebacker. But maybe just uh, what they have brought uh, in that first season on the field and now in spring ball. Uh, I think they've they've brought a lot of passion to the defense. Uh, they they won't let you get away with much, and uh, they they are going to hold us accountable, get us running to the ball, get us in our gaps, uh, no excuses. So that, that that's what the defense needs. Nine and a half sacks last season overall. Uh, do you think, maybe not even for personal glory, but do you think about numbers? Do you look at your, your season totals, 14 and a half tackles for loss, nine and a half sacks? And, and if so, what, what do you think about when you see the numbers? Uh, definitely not during the season. I, I wouldn't say that I, I looked at that stuff. Uh, I think my, my roommates keep up with that stuff more than I do. Mm -hmm. But uh, – when it, when it's brought to my attention, I start to think, uh, you know, how, what did I do to get to that point? How can I further improve and uh, you know raise raise the bar, especially this season? A lot of times, uh, as one of your predecessors, Aston Whiteside, found out, you may not get the stats because after people see film on you and how you okay. you dominate McMurray, they double team, right? Right, right. Yeah. So you have to adjust. Right, you do. Um, as with the. Some things that I saw was the double team, the uh, back chipping you, the mm -hmm. quarterback rolling out to the other side. Mm -hmm. I guess you just, you just have to uh, uh, recognize that, uh, do a little bit of scouting, and see how the best way you can get to the quarterback. Rising junior in the fall of 2013. Uh, in spring ball this year, uh, do you feel any added sense of leadership, uh, being a guy who's been around now for three seasons? And if so, what, what do you, how would you define what it means to be a good leader as a player? I think a good leader leads by example, and uh, that, I think that's what I do mostly. Uh, I do need to be more vocal with uh, the freshmen who are coming in. Uh, did you have guys who did that with you? Yes, I did. Like uh, who? Uh, Bryson Lewis. Oh, yeah. uh, he Kevin, wasn't afraid to let you know. No, he wasn't. Uh, Kevin Washington, uh, Fred Thompson, yeah, yeah. Ashton Whiteside. I, there was a, a big group of leaders when I, when I first came in. Uh, uh, if I could just pick up some things from them and learn how to lead some of those freshmen and underclassmen. Now you grew up in a D1 city, I Waco. Uh, have you thought much about uh, going Division One and, and, and playing uh, every week uh, on a Division One level? Uh, I don't. I haven't thought that much about it. I just know uh, do do what I'm supposed to. Uh, I think the coaches will handle that as far as game plan and scheme. And uh, football's football. All right. 
It is indeed, and spring football continues. Nick Richardson, junior defensive lineman, one of the big parts of the ACU defense as the 2013 season approaches. For ACUsports.com, I'm Grant Boone.